Welcome back to Let's Play Shattered Courage! And I just got the boss key for level 1. Making good progress here so far. Oh, and I have 50 rupees, yay. Oh no, I have to kill a bloody pea hat. This sucks. No. I wish this room was more open. Okay, I got him in one round. That's that's pretty decent. Okay, I haven't been down here, so... Staircase. Good. Arrows! Yay! Oh, I thought that key dropped the arrows. <laughs> I wonder if you can have keys dropping items in these passageways here. Probably. I don't know if anyone's ever tried that. I'm pretty sure it would be doable. I could try doing it in Z Quest. Just for a lark, but why bother? Oh wait, can I smack this guy here? Yay, pathway. Oh, okay, so this is a new room. I haven't been here before. I once shot an arrow at a stone statue, and weird things happened. Like I was locked in this room forever. And hit by a young kid. Haha. <laughs> okay, so what's down here? So obviously just goes back to the entrance, but whatever. It's fine. Do 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 Yay! How come I haven't gotten the map yet? And where was the boss door? Was it up here? Oh, well... Oh, uh... No, I saw the flashing light of the compass, but... The boss door is right here. Hmm. Well, what's in the compass room? Master Wizrob! Okay, so I guess it would be prudent to use the arrows here. Oh man, I'm actually gonna have to try to avoid this guy. Oi! Stupid Aquamentuses. Ouch. Oh, I'm actually fighting Ganon! Yay, that was... That oh, wasn't too bad, I guess. Alright, let me go find that other statue again. Oh, there's one right here, too. Oh, I can go forward now, I guess, but there's still another one eyed statue. Go away. Oh, potion. Uh, sure, why not? The only thing is if I get the letter slash mushroom slash whatever it is in this game, I'm gonna have to have no potions in order to open up what's in a potion shop, should there be a potion shop in this game. I don't know if there is, so I guess it's pretty safe right now. Oh, and it sure would be nice to get that uh, improved wallet. I'm still quite short. I can't get that. Oh well. well I don't think I'm any in any immediate danger of going over 255 rupees. So hey all. Well, that was a weird thing happening here. Quite the powerful arrow. Warp caves. Okay. So it brings me to... Snowy area. Yay, snowy area. 
Holy crap, these are like blue Lynels, aren't they? Or are they Octoroks? They might be Octoroks. Okay, they're Octoroks. Whoa! Is this the same place, kind of? So there's like a forest world and an ice world? Like, parallel worlds! Well, this shop survived okay. Oh, I can buy the rupee bag there too. Nice. But there's no grass or anything to slash rupees out of. You know, this ice wall looks like it's only about two or three feet high. It wouldn't be that much of an effort to climb up it, Link! And more houses buried, buried under the ice. Too bad. Well, I wonder how that happened. Were they buried under water to begin with? I mean, if stuff froze, then I don't see how it would end up under water and then under ice. Maybe, like, there was a massive hurricane or a massive flood and then everything just froze. Due to global warming or something like that. I don't know. What do I look like? A damn climatologist? Hmm. So I have 16 bombs now, that's nice. Don't really know where I'm going. Hopefully to another level. I've already been here. No, I haven't. Okay. A lot of tectites. That's nice. Eh, whatever. Okay, can't get past there. And... Give me money, please. Oh, yay! A ladder to go up here. So, what's up here? More bushes to slash. Well, I guess I'm nearing another level. Yay! Another level! Yay! Another level! Hey, where's the other level? Alright, 20 bombs. Do I not have a limit or something? Not complaining, but it's nice to know how far I can go. Oh, now I can afford the bigger rupee wallet. Yay. But the shop's kind of far away, so save it for later. Hmm. Ah, a cave. But I don't know if I can push those rocks. They look kind of heavy to me. Oh, there's a statue thing in there, too. Okay. Hey! What the hell? Do I need to boomerang this? Hey! Do I need to push these? Hey! Okay, well... That's not fair, man. Oh, 20 rupees that I can't get. Hmm. Whoa, more eyeball Octorox. They're shooting like massive eye crusties at me. Gross. They need some. Hey, another warp cave. This is like hidden duality, isn't it? The exact same game as Hidden Duality. Whoa. Can I get behind here? No. Although I've only played Hidden Duality a little bit. Go back to... Forest World. Yay! Or Desert World. Let's see. Eh, there's a town. Okay. So this is like 
if Parallel Worlds and Hidden Duality had a baby. <laughs> well, I don't know, this might have been made before either. Well, probably not before Parallel Worlds. That was a long time ago, wasn't it? I haven't. Re I played Parallel Worlds a bit, but that game's just awful. <laughs> I mean, I don't know how, how how difficult it is to make a Super Nintendo hack of Legend of Zelda. I'm guessing it's pretty damn hard. So I don't really want to talk too much about that because I mean, there's very very few. Ouch! How come these guys can throw their boomerangs all the way across the screen? That's no fair. But anyways, there's really no... Where did they go? Ah. Okay, whatever. There are very, very few Super Nintendo Legend of Zelda ROM hacks, I guess. I mean, if you go to Zelda Classic, there's like thousands of quests by now, probably. And like, Parallel Worlds... It was it was fun at first. I mean, like the overworld's really nice. The guardhouse was pretty fun, but then you get to the levels and they're just awful. They're they're horrible levels. Like every single level is just worse than the next. Like Impa's ways, that's so boring. That one where you have to fall down all the holes just to find the right way. What the hell is this? Magic container? Yay. Like, Naburu's hole. <laughs> Naburu's hole. <laughs> and, you know, I don't really mind the difficulty or anything. Just, you know, make the levels better. That's all I gotta say. Then I had nothing to do with making that game, and I don't know what it really takes to edit anything in that game, so I mean, if there were those limitations, then so be it. So I got the candle. Was there anything I could do with it? Oh, what the hell am I doing? Wait, I can go over there? Why am I going back? Why are you going back, Link? Link, you need to think. Now I'm thinking that I missed something pretty major by level 1, by opening up that statue. How come the Gorias disappear when I come in from the bottom there? I don't get it, man. Maybe there's something in Zelda Classic like if you don't put in the wooden boomerang or you give the player the magical boomerang first, that makes the Gorias all have the magic boomerang. Oops. Because usually, they only have the wooden boomerang. No matter what. Or maybe it's an option in, Z in Zelda Classic, but I don't remember any options like that. Yeah, another potion. So, what's the point of this? Okay, a waterfall. Can I push this? No. Uh-oh! Graphical glitch. Oh, and... What? Do I need the hookshot? Uh-oh. Maybe I came here too early. Uh, and I really hate when the candle takes magic to use. It's so annoying. Oh, those are triple fires. Okay, good. So I can get magic there. And that's good thinking, you know? If you're gonna force the player to use magic, at least have some enemies that refill magic. Uh-oh. Sometimes you find that kind of oversight in quests where you need to use a lot of magic, but then there are no enemies that actually give magic, so you're stuck. Or you have to go way, way back to find a place that has magic. But anyway, it looks like I have to go back to the ice world now. Perhaps I have to find the 
hook shot or something. Oh, I can go this way too. Yay! Okay, well, let's see if I can find anything in the next minute or so. Hopefully, there's a level or something. Can I burn any of these bushes here? I have to be careful, because... I don't have infinite magic, you know? Ow. Well... Can't use it twice. On the same screen. Ow! Yeah, I guess I needed the hammer. Oh well. Okay, a staircase. Where does this go? Magic! Okay, I'll take one. And I'll end this episode off here. Next time on Let's Play Shattered Courage, we search around more for level 2. See you later.